Today you're going to learn how to make a very basic PowerPoint show. Some of you may already know how to do that, so this will be a good review for you. Once you open up PowerPoint under Microsoft Office, you will see a blank title slide. You see the text boxes, and you need a text box to add any text to your slides. This is called a slide, and these are your text boxes. So you click inside, and since we're going to do a presentation on a country of your choice, I'm going to choose Bangladesh. So I type that in. And then you click inside the subtitle, and I'm going to type my name, Deb Ramirez. Now I want to add a color theme background to it, so I'm going to go up to the toolbar called Design, and you can select from any of these designs and click on the down arrow for more. And I'm going to go with a very basic one. Oh, let's see. Let's go with the. Uh, does it look like Bangladesh? Uh, let me go with the. Um, there we go. I'm going to go with the orange one. Okay. Do not spend a lot of time on picking your themes. You can always change them later. Okay. Now I want a new slide, so I'm going to go back to the Home tab, and where it says New Slide, I just click on that, and I have my second slide. Now I'm going to talk about maybe greetings, and I can click inside the second text box, and I can put another word or two there, and I'm going to show between men and women. Okay, I want to make that a little larger, so I highlight it that, and I come up to the toolbar for the font formatting, and where you see the number 18, I click on the down arrow, and I may want to make that about 36. Now I want my greetings to be a little larger, so I'm going to highlight that, and make that about 54. You can also change the color, but I'm going to leave it at white because it shows up nice on this orange background. Now I want to insert a picture, and many times the best way to use a PowerPoint is to talk from pictures. So I'm going to insert a new slide again, and you can, you can highlight these boxes and delete them by cutting. You can do Control X from the keyboard. I'm just going to look for a picture. So I'm going to put Insert and I click on picture and I already have some pictures up here but I need to find the one on my project and this is one good reason why you name things very specifically so you can find them okay so I'm going to go and let's see I'm going to choose a picture of the globe there okay so I want to make this a little smaller, so I click on the corners and hold the button down and drag it. Now I can leave it like that, or you can actually make it the whole size of your screen, and that's very powerful when you come to the screens. Now you need to be careful when you drag from the middle, it may distort it, which means changes the shape, but that's not too bad. Now when this slide comes up, I'm going to talk and possibly show you on the picture here where our country is and that Bangladesh is on the other side of the world. Okay, now you want to save this, so you're going to come up to File and click Save As. And be sure you remember where you're saving it. I already have a special name on it. And then I'm going to click Save. And there you have it, a very basic introduction to making your PowerPoint show. Have a great day.